How was it when you were in Ohio? Um, it was not very diverse in the sense that I would like it. Like I was the only, pretty much the only Spanish speaking person there, the only Hispanic, the only Latino, um, and pretty much, you know, the entire school. There were some people who were kind of more descendant side, but you know, not body, nobody who was an immigrant directly. Um, so it, it was a bit alienating at times where I didn't really know where I fitted in. Mm-hmm. And that kind of t- took a toll on me, which is something, you know, obviously you don't want to see. But once I came down to Miami and kind of in- reintroduced myself into the, the environment that I was familiar with, I became more comfortable, especially mm-hmm. here at FIU. I remember my first semester, we worked together on SparkDev. Mm-hmm. Um, that was a very interesting project that's still on my resume to this day, and I yeah. still talk about it. Um, Code Clash. We love Code Clash. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But, yeah, it's, uh, I've always valued different perspectives and mm-hmm. i think it's very important especially when you're developing something you want to think about every user and every use case you know mm-hmm. if you're somebody let's say from canada you may not have um, the insight that somebody from argentina may have in-